my name is Rodney Hill, and now we're going to talk a little bit about ICB, ITB tools, also our Tensor TBP, our Tensor SRB, and our Selector 6 batteries. So we have three different types of batteries that work with different variants of these tools. We have a 14 volt battery, an 18 volt battery, and a 36 volt battery. For our ICB, for our Selector 6, we can use the 14 volt battery or we can use any of the larger batteries as well. For our higher torque tools, they will require either the 18 or 36 volt battery, depending on the torque and, and the application that they're being used on. So this generation of batteries is very smart. And one of the things these batteries can do, you can click on the button on the battery to see what the battery's level is. So you'll see two things here. You'll see the lights come on that indicate the state of charge. And around the outside of that, you'll see an indicator that's either green, yellow, or red. And that will tell you if the battery, um, as, uh, how the battery health is. So as the battery ages and can hold less of a charge, that will turn yellow. And eventually it'll turn red, telling you that it's time to replace the battery. So these batteries, if we take a look at this one, I have two LEDs lit out of three. So that means I have roughly a two-thirds charge on the battery. If I take a look at the 36 volt battery I have right here, I can see that I have a blinking red light. And what that indicates is that the battery is empty. So if I put this on the tool, the tool's not gonna run. This battery needs to be charged. So I'm gonna take this battery and I'm gonna put it on our flex charger. This charger works with all three of these batteries here. These chargers can be daisy chained together. So you can have multiple chargers connected to the same power supply. They can also be mounted vertically on something like 8020 rail and they plug into regular AC 220 volt or 110 volt power. So I will connect my 36 volt battery to the charger and I can see on the charger, it lights up and it's telling me the status of the charge. So it shows me again, the health status there is green, which is good. And I can see the LEDs increment there as it's charging. When it gets closer to completion, you'll only see the LEDs blink at the, at the very end. And then when it's finished, the LEDs will be solid white. So it's that easy to use these batteries with all of these different products that you see here. Uh, we're glad to have one battery family now that works with um, accessories, tools, and, and other products. This has been a quick overview of our batteries and charging process. If you have any questions, please contact your Atlas Copco representative. And thanks for watching.